بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم Don't you agree that in the month of Ramadan the hearts are softened? We tend to reach out in charitable deeds much more in the month of Ramadan than we do during the other months. Not to say that we are not charitable in them too. But it is the condition of the heart that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has definitely granted us such a gift regarding that we feel the goodness make use of it. There is no point in saying this Ramadan is blessed. The recitation of the Quran that the Imam is reading is so good. The lectures we've heard are so powerful, yet we have not turned. What is the point of hearing powerful lectures one after the other when we have done nothing about it? It is like seeing the best business deal in front of us and we did not participate or we did not earn and we did not earn any profit. So my brothers and sisters, it is up to us to start up with the dealing with Allah. هَلْ أَدُلُّكُمْ عَلَىٰ تِجَارَةٍ تُنْجِيكُمْ مِنْ عَذَابٍ أَلِيمٍ Allah says, should I not show you that business that you shall engage in that will result in your savior from some painful punishment? What is it? تُؤْمِنُونَ بِاللَّهِ وَرَسُولِهِ Believe in Allah and his messenger and strive in his path with your wealth and yourselves. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us steadfast on the path. My brothers and sisters, this is the month of resolutions. Make your resolutions here and now. Promise Allah you will quit your bad habits. This may be the last chance you have in order to do that. You may quit your bad habits, whether it be as trivial as some may think. Habits such as smoking, habits that people may never ever be proud of, such as being hooked onto pornography, such as gambling, such as alcohol, whatever else it may be. Some may be hooked on adultery. Brothers and sisters, this is your chance to earn forgiveness of Allah. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's mercy, the blessed month of Ramadan, the day of a Friday, the time of the khutbah. Isn't it about time that our hearts are softened towards Allah? Quit those habits, cut them now. Promise Allah and believe me, if you were to die right here, right now, perhaps Allah would grant you paradise just because of the goodness of your heart and your intention. May Allah forgive us all.